If you visited downtown Harlan, Hazard, or Pikeville lately, you may have seen a Before I Die board. The boards are a national trend, and Bluegrass Hospice is sponsoring the idea across the state. WYMT Sarah Anderson takes us to Harlan County, where dreams are written daily. A year has come and gone since southeastern Kentucky watched Harlan County native Jordan Smith win the hearts of America with his voice of the mountains. And one simple thing is passing along hope to others in his hometown. He really inspired me to go and, you know, put myself out there more, and he showed me that it's really possible that you really can do it. Brooklyn Collins is writing down her goal to share with her community on the Before I Die board. Yeah, I think it creates a very positive outlook on Harlan, and it'll give people hope to pursue their dreams. Others have the same feelings. No dream is too big. Um, we do come from a small town. We come from a region that is quite overlooked. But whenever you put your dreams out there and pursue them, you can even make big results. You can make big splashes in the world. This board and these pieces of chalk will not make dreams come true. But folks say there's something special about sharing aspirations with other people. When you write down your dreams, when you write down your goals, it's one of those things that like, it makes it a little bit more concrete. It seems a little bit more achievable. So if you see a board, they say don't be afraid to make your mark. They see it, they pursue it, and then it becomes reality. In Harlan County, Sarah Anderson, WYMT Mountain News. There, like we said, there is also a wall in Pikeville and in Hazard across from People's Bank.